Hey y'all, Crystal here today, and I created this video because I've gotten so many DMs and questions about the Apple Podcast changes. So that's what we're gonna talk about today, so let's get right to it. So if you are a podcaster, you probably got some shocking news in the last 24 hours, yes, I'm putting this up like 24 hours, not even after the news of Apple Podcast recent changes coming out. There was an article, it was like Apple's, you know, event of the year, we're gonna give you all the updates. Y'all still remember like when Steve Jobs would do this and everyone would just like freak out like what's coming up next? Well, an Apple's news review or newsroom, whatever it was called, article came out kind of documenting their changes that are coming for Apple Podcasts starting in May 2021. So if you are not currently podcasting, I don't really know what implications this will have to get you approved. Is it gonna be a slower process because these other changes are coming. I don't know as of right now, as of me recording this video, but for current podcasters, I do know a few things that you need to do right now. You need to go and reconnect your account in Apple Podcasts because things have changed. I had to reconnect my account and now I see a screen that's saying, you have to wait a few hours before you're actually going to get approved. I had to go through a process of saying whether I was an individual or a business, and I had to name my account. I named it a business under my profit media. This is my LLC that I have for my entire business. And um, I found an article that had some other great information about Apple Podcasts and what they were doing. So I'm gonna give you my thoughts on that now. Okay, so I'm on a specific help article that I found. Uh, I'll put a link in the video description so you know exactly what this was. But as it says here, starting in early May, channels and subscriptions will be available to anyone in the Apple beta software program. So like I said earlier, I don't know what this means for someone that is brand new to podcasting and they're just uh, getting connected for the first time. I have had podcasts already on Apple Podcasts, so it'll be interesting to see what it's gonna be like. But you have the ability to sell your subscription. I don't know exactly how this is going to work. Like I said, I have more questions than answers, but I do see how this could benefit your listeners, your audience, because you can define which benefits this means. Do you want ad-free listening? additional episodes, early access, sus subscriber only shows, or archive access to like access to previous episodes. So with Apple podcast subscriptions, you receive 70% of the subscription price at each billing cycle. So it's a way for you to monetize your content. But again, I have only more questions. So how it works is, you have to pay the annual podcasters program for an annual fee. Now, from what I've researched, I've seen it, it's $19.99 USD for a year. Again, I don't have all the details on how this works for international people. Is this available for anyone that's international? I don't know. Um, and then I see you can create channels, do subscriptions, uh, to get started, you simply sign in to your Apple Podcast account, join the program, do your agreement, and you can set up a show for a, a subscription and uh, figure out if you wanna do a channel. So all of this is super interesting. Um, I'm gonna link to everything in the video description, but I hope that you found this helpful today. So at the end of the day, what does this mean for us podcasters? Well, I think that it means that we need to continue to ask questions and understand all of this better. It is brand new, hot off the press, so I think that questions will be answered over time. But at the end of the day, I hope that you are encouraged to keep podcasting because as I've seen, as you know, I've gone on this journey over three years, things have evolved so much, so, so much in the last three years and technology moves so quickly. So I hope that a change in how you podcast doesn't 
kick you out of the game or get you discouraged. I hope that you're encouraged to keep learning what this means for podcasters and keep sharing that special message that you have. So if you're brand new to this channel, make sure you hit that subscribe button below, hit the thumbs up on this video if you found it helpful. And as always, remember, keep it up. We all have to start somewhere.